brushing your dog's teeth is one of the best things you can do to improve your pet's oral and dental health. While this video can be very helpful, be sure to discuss brushing your pet's teeth with your veterinarian for additional information. Like any other training method, it's best to introduce the process to your dog gradually, preferably in a quiet, distraction-free environment. Depending on the temperament and the aptitude of the dog, you can adjust the level of training to accomplish what you can in one session. Once you're both comfortable, pet your dog around its head, either from the front or from the back or side, and you should offer a little bit of the toothpaste from your finger or the toothbrush to let your dog know that this could be tasty. Since I'm right-handed, I like to gently grasp the muzzle with my left hand to provide some gentle control and avoid the possibility of an accidental bite. I just start using my hand swiping down the side of the face along the cheeks while starting to gently lift the lips with the movement. With an incident finger toothbrush and a small amount of toothpaste, I introduce my finger just inside the lip gap to rub the outside surfaces of the front teeth. Repeat this simple process until he's more comfortable with the movements. Be sure to praise him after a good session. Then I progress to using the dual-ended toothbrush in the same way I used the finger toothbrush. After letting him lick the toothpaste off the toothbrush, I gently grasp the muzzle and then I lift the upper lip slightly to be able to get the toothbrush in that lip gap and onto the two surfaces with a gentle motion back and forth. As the process progresses, you can get your dog accustomed to having the toothbrush extend further back to clean the molars and work on the incisors in the front of the mouth. The best toothbrush action is having the bristles positioned at a 45 degree angle to the tooth surface with the bristles aimed towards the gum line. Work the toothbrush in a circular motion on all the outer surfaces of the teeth I know some owners whose dogs will let them brush the inner surfaces of the teeth, but that can be quite difficult. Tartar tends to build up on the teeth on the upper jaw in the back, so concentrating on these teeth can help a lot. Don't be discouraged if you can't do it every day or if you're still seeing some tartar build up. Try to do it as often as you can, and on those days that you can't brush, make sure they get a good dental chew or rinse instead. Even with great brushing, some plaque and tartar will accumulate, which is why home care is one part of a complete dental program that includes professional cleaning, polishing, and dental x-rays, just like we do with our dentists.